Hello there, Sir from 17 once again, introducing you to my Dark Souls video walkthrough. This is the Bed of Chaos boss fight. Uh, this sucks balls. <laughs> I'm not going to lie, I'm not going to sugarcoat it, because nobody wants sugarcoated balls. But when you enter this room, you have to hit three things and the boss dies. You only have to hit them once, and on paper it should be fun, but it's not. So what you want to do, the way I always go, is I go left first, then right, then middle, obviously. You can go right if you want, then left, I just choose. I always go left, I don't know why, but what's going to happen here is, is once you break through these, these roots, you hit this, you're going to see a little animation of the boss taking damage, but I'm struggling to, to actually hit this because the katana is pretty weak. There's the, the boss taking damage. What's going to happen now is he's going to get additional attacks and the floor is going to start falling down. And the main reason this boss sucks is because when he hits you, he sweeps you into holes because he knocks you over. But what I'm doing here is if you quit to the menu and you reload, you will be outside the boss door. This is a little trick that I saw on the wiki and it does actually help because the amount of times I've died making my journey from the left hand side back to the center to get to the right hand side is, is quite high so now I can skip that and I can run directly for the right hand side so you need your shield up immediately as you run put it up run over here tank the hit be careful of the hand coming from behind you be careful going over this route you see the ground drop there when you get to this point you are safe from the swipe what you aren't safe from is if he does any of the fire attacks and the boss does do fire, but it's kind of rare. The only problem is, if you're gonna get unlucky, it's gonna be with a fire attack, because it pretty much one-shots you if you don't have really high vitality or really high fire resist. And something to notice as well, if he, if you get down onto the middle branch when you're running towards the, the final core of the boss, he can sweep you off if you're under him, because the detection's really bad. Also, when you get to the core and you're breaking the branches, he can hit you with a pyromancy, which does massive damage. So you can even die once you think you've done it. But there's his spell. I was kind of shit my pants here. And there's the damage from it as he's swiping me. And this is what you've got to fall onto. You've got to drop onto here. Once you're here, you are safe from the, the swipes. Heal up. Be careful, though, as you come up here. Because if he swipes again, he can knock you off. So make sure your shield's up. Uh, roll or slash your way through these barbs through his sticks and this, this reed and what have you and get to this area as quickly as possible as soon as you're close to this little maggot here just attack it with everything you can lock on so you definitely hit it as soon as you hit it you're good to go the boss is dead but that is much more difficult than it looks guys I can't even tell you how hard that boss is I say hard it's not hard it's bullshit but there you go fingers crossed you'll have a nice easy time this video looks like I had an easy time, but I think he killed me twice. Uh, I've just edited those out so that it's a more streamless guy, uh, stream, streamline guide. Streamless? I don't even think that's a word. How can you lessen a stream? But now I'm looking through my inventory uh, to get my stuff back on as I had it before. There's the Lord Soul that we needed. There's the bonfire. We'll get some souls in. Oh, we might have just gotten the souls because I've suddenly got 84,000. So you want to spend a couple of those on levels or upgrading, depending on what your preference is. I'm going to put them into Endurance. And then you can warp back to Firelink or back to Anorlondo. And yeah, that's pretty much it. We just need to take the, the rest of the Lord Souls and then take on the final boss. But what am I doing? That is the real question. I'm just chilling out at the bonfire. Am I just stopping and starting recording? Maybe something along those lines? I can't tell. Yeah, it's probably the end of the video, guys. Thanks for watching, and you take care now.